Hey, what's up guys and gals? My name is Rick9G. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're going to be talking about Batman the 1960s television show. More specifically, I'm going to be talking about a two-part episode called The Puzzles Are Coming and The Duo Is Slumming. Now, along with this, we're going to talk a little bit about the villain, what the episode was about, but specifically about Robin and the error that could have cost him and production close to 20 million dollars in 2020 united states valuation that is something that you're going to absolutely want to hear about and hear about how it happened let's get right to it guys and gals now as i mentioned this is a two-part episode it stars or co-stars i would say the guest villain the puzzler now he was played by maurice evans now many have even referred to this as one of the worst villains one of the worst episodes of batman i discussed this in one of my last videos maybe i'll do one where i discuss all the worst episodes or the worst classified episodes it might be a little fun considering how this show is cheesy now what actually happens in this episode is that the puzzler, who is a villain with a fondness for both Shakespeare and aviation, he indicates that he is after a fortune, a fortune owned by Artemis Nab. Now he convinces the billionaire Nab to invest in his puzzle balloon business, but when the dynamic duel find that Nab seems really intelligent to fall for this phony scheme, they look deeper for the true intentions of this criminal. Now the search leads them to Nab's airplane monopoly and airplane hangar and airport in fact and this is where the puzzler has plans to halt their investigations once and for all. Now this is where the issue happened and that is again at this airport. While they were filming there was a fight scene that they had with Robin, some of the henchmen that is Robin was played by Burt Ward and what actually happened while well, they're next to this Learjet, this giant jet that they use used which in my mind added a bit of gravitas to what was going on in the episode. There were tons of planes here and there, but they wanted the piece de resistance. They wanted that Learjet in the background showing, yes, there's a lot of money, criminality, corruption going on here, and this Learjet is the exemplary um, image of all of this villainy and corruption. Now, this actually comes from the stuntman, the stuntman for Burt Ward. Now, you may know that Burt Ward, who played Robin, didn't do all of the fighting scenes. They put stuntmen in there to make it a little easier for the character. They would zoom out, and that's why we get these shots here. His name was Victor Paul. Now, he recalled that the actual owner of the Learjet was there on set, making sure that they wouldn't destroy what he owned or wouldn't mistreat it in any way. And so he was standing there, as I mentioned, and watching. Now, the fight scene called that the group of men were actually on top of the Learjet in terms of where the wing was, where the engine was, and they were supposed to kind of push him along into the engine. Now, the engine wasn't running, so there was no danger in that sense. However, one of the actors who was playing the fat henchman, those are the words that Victor Paul used, he got on the wing and the plane actually tilted down. It tilted down to one side toward the wheel. Now, this is a plane that in 1966 is worth two and a half million dollars. Now, a plane that in 2020 is worth two and a half million dollars is really expensive, but a two and a half million dollar plane in 1966 is worth $19,786,322. That is in 2020 valuation. Now you could understand why the owner of the Learjet would get upset and even super worried at them possibly damaging the plane. Now it actually leaned the plane way over and it actually touched the ground. That's something that you don't want to happen with a plane. I know that as a pilot. Now the owner himself ran out in front of the scene, interrupted the fact that they were filming and said, what are you doing? This is a two and a half million dollar plane and you guys are going to ruin it. So just imagine this crazy story of having the Burt Ward stuntman pushed into the area of the engine. They caused permanent damage to the plane and render it a 20 million dollar loss wow just like that in a couple of seconds just for a few seconds on camera for this tv show let me know what you think guys and gals was it the smartest thing to have them on top of the plane maybe they should have been in front of the plane using the plane as a type of background shot but no they decided hey let's get on this wing of this million dollar plane and see if the shot looks any better i don't know if that was up to the director the producer or who decided that but the owner was 
was not happy guys and gals incidentally the plane wasn't actually really damaged at all but i do have to note that this was something that did happen on set and it did interrupt filming we'll see you next time guys and gals don't forget to always subscribe and like this video if you do enjoy it we are right on the cusp of a hundred thousand subscribers and most importantly be hopeful Thank you so much to my Diamond Tier patrons, Citizen Kane 359, Paul T, Ricky, Gary N, David D, Sally N, Yasmin G, and Lori K. If you want to be part of the Patreon family, don't forget to take a look at the description with many exclusives that you can enjoy.